Demons again in their home runs as they move left to right in the opening period. The Rocket in their own whites with the blue and red trim. They, of course, the affiliates of the Montreal Canadiens. Full elevator it out to Kondata in center. Rosen hits the deck and spins it through the middle of the ice. On the right side, Ulan and threw it in front. They score! Brandon Zinyak was crashing to the front of the net. Ulanen found him on what was a sloppy transition play for the team. It's defensively, Rosen fell down and it created all sorts of trouble. Zinyak gets the rocket. A another first goal in a contest. This one far earlier than in game one. Just 5-26 in. It's 1-0 Laval. Pekka moves the other way with Neal. Neal over the left point side. Back to Pekka. Pekka breaking into the forehand. He could not stop it home. One move too many for Pekka in tight. Primo stayed right with him. Ulanen now back the other way. Right wing feet. Actually, Ulanen held onto it. Ulanen a shot off the glove of Lindgren and in. Yes, the Ulanen has snuck it through Charlie Lindgren. Perhaps off a deflection in tight, and the Rocket now lead 2-0 with 8.54 to go in the first. Now let on the tape to Joshua. Joshua across the line. Right wing feet is to Bitten. Bitten to the corner. Forced back by Ouellette. Bitten maintains control. Bitten continues the cycle. Joshua and then McEachern. McEachern a jam play. He scores! Just what the doctor ordered after so many chances last night for McEachern. Bondonato could not quite control the puck. He settles it in the corner. And in behind the net, Martel now looking to get away from Tucker. Martel steps in front of the back door. Feet is right on the tape, and Belzeal scores. Nifty play by Martel behind the net as Tucker trying to force him on his backhand, but Belzeal was swinging right through the top of the crease. Martel found him beautifully in just 3.05 into his second. The Rocket have reestablished their two goal lead. It's now 3 1. Teasdale in across the Springfield zone before Costin caught up on the back check. Bitten will now race up the left wing. Will Bitten trying to get a step. Bitten slams on the brakes, waits, throws it across, and what a save by Primo on Tommy Cross. Race for Lupac. Woolen and knocked it down in front of Washburn, and now behind the defense, Kondata's in with a shot glove save, Lindgren. Right handed robbery from Charlie Lindgren to keep his team within two. Still 3 1 for the Rocket. Corey Schuneman inside his own zone. Throw a pass out through center. Harvey Pinard gets hold of it. His right wing feed Ulanen. Yes, Ulanen centers and Harvey Pinard scores. Once again, yes, Ulanen making it happen for the Rocket. That time Harvey Pinard crashed the front of the goal and was able to one touch it in behind Lindgren on the two on one. And the Rocket lead is now four to one. Santini from behind his goal, looking to get it started. You got to try to take a comeback three goals down in spurts. Can't try to get it all back at once. Sounds obvious enough, but sometimes it's easy to be frustrated. McGing a steal, McGing centers, they score! Cliff passed it, and there's one in the road back. Just two, 24 into the third, it's four to two. He'll find Harvey Pinard. Harvey Pinard over the left wing leaves for Niku. He'll fire off the stick of Kessel. That will do it. As the T-Birds for the first time in these Calder Cup playoffs on the wrong end of a final score. And this series is going to head back to Laval. All even at a game apiece. Laval takes game two.